Hey what's up everyone, so welcome back to another video and today I'm playing some CSGO but I want to speak more about like all this drama bullshit on YouTube that's happening on the last maybe last days that it's like a bit too much and even FussyTube like he made a video uh, like a fake video and he explains he shows everything there because the point of that video was it's like to expose the drama channels or the channels that they speak only about like news and reporting stuff but what's I mean I understand the point of Fussy too because he's I mean correct on on his idea on what he tried to show on the on that video because I mean he faked the video and he mentioned that uh, you will see like about this video we posted it on Twitter and you will see those channels tomorrow we'll make a video about uh, speaking about this and actually happened that Scarce uh, made a video about that because Scarce uh, he makes videos about he reports like everything that happens on Twitter from, <laughs> and I mean there's nothing also wrong with that with reporting uh, news uh, and then like drama uh, channel there is drama alerts or drama channel that also made a video about that and he mentioned that those um, those channels will make video about it and so it is like exposing uh, those channels but I mean those channels that reports this kind of stuff uh, it's also like nothing wrong by doing that but I understand the point of FussyTube and I think in some way he's correct because those channels they use his name, his pictures, his tweets, his videos and put on their videos. For example, Scarce, uh, he he loves to do, he makes video uh, gameplay of videos and puts uh, like, the whole his, his videos are, uh, he's playing a game, Call of Duty or Counter Strike or whatever, and then he speaks about this news that he reports about, and then he takes like pictures from tweets or from uh, like he takes the videos that happened, uh, and then he puts on the video itself and then he, he speaks about it but what's more like I think it's like incorrect or clickbait is that, like, his thumbnails and his titles because on the on his thumbnails he takes pictures from these people that he's reporting and puts on the thumbnails and then he take his the names of these people and puts also on the on the title not even on the description but on the title so for example if someone searches for, searches for FussyTube and they go they go to, to Scare's video which they see FussyTube image on the thumbnail and also see his name on the on the description on the title not on the description like FussyTube uh, says say that or FussyTube do, did that or FussyTube exposed stuff like that and people go click that and probably will subscribe if they like it or get get views for for scares and also money and I mean I understand the point of scares as well because I mean he's just reporting whatever happened on Twitter or YouTube or with overall youtubers but this is like taking the name or the brand of those people and using their name to get to get views for you which this is I think the point of FussyTube because those channels like they use their names to get views and also money of course because every video it makes money uh, but yeah I mean this old bu bullshit old drama I mean I understand the point of scares because he d doesn't really like make drama he just reports whatever happened and speaks about that but I mean when you report everything that happened which most of the times it's only like bad things that happened or for example a youtuber said fuck you to another youtuber so like he's reporting only negative stuff or some youtuber went to jail or whatever 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 uh, I mean he doesn't report good news because I mean if he will report good news nobody will care about good news uh, because it seems like everyone want, wants to watch drama so he gets views about that of course but I mean this is like the only like I think in my opinion the only wrong that scares is doing uh, because when you when you watch for example you find his video you see a picture on the thumbnail and you see a description and then when you click on the video you get a gameplay for, from a game from Call of Duty or from Counter Strike with him with him commenting about what happened which he never, he doesn't state on, on the title or even on, on the thumbnail that he's playing a game and then speaking about whatever happened. Uh, so I think this is the point that uh, FussyTube wanted to point out. Which I mean FussyTube also like he did prank, prank, uh, fake pranks, whatever. And oh man, all this drama bullshit. Uh, that's why I have normal, most of the time I try to, to use 
or to make thumbnails from from the gameplay I'm I'm doing because I don't really want negativity, don't really want drama. Even how I'm small, like, I will never get like drama or someone to speak like oh ghost other said that or ghost other did that because how I'm small nobody cares about me but also how I'm, how I'm small I don't really want to get into the negativity part I always like positivity don't really I don't I'm not really into the negativity part or to drama part uh, and also when I see like this news videos on YouTube or this drama I, I just skip them because I don't really want to watch this oh the exposed uh, fussy tube got exposed or uh, scarce got exposed or whatever ah oh, man this is like when you when you see the, the the title exposed or went to jail or whatever okay this is just this is drama and this will be like negativity and yeah <laughs> fuck it but yeah let me know what you think about this all this drama or if it's not drama or what you think about it but yeah thank you guys for watching and I'll see you on the next one Gonna get this.